The results of this year's LA homeless count was released this morning. Volunteers gathered the data back in January to determine how many people were unhoused. KTLA 5's Kimberly Chang live now in downtown LA where Mayor Karen Bass held a news conference to discuss the results. Kimberly. Glenn High and the results show that the homelessness crisis in the greater LA area is getting worse. According to the 2023 homeless count, the results show that the number of unhoused people in LA has gone up. Take a look at this full screen. Some key data released this morning. It's estimated more than 75,000 people are unhoused on any given night in LA County, an increase of 9%. And in the city of LA, there was a 10% rise in homelessness, bringing the number to roughly 4%. 46,000 people. Compare that to last year when they counted about 69,000 people experiencing homelessness in LA County and 42,000 in the city of LA. Now, according to data from the Los Angeles Homeless Services Authority, LASA, the rise in the homeless population is happening in our neighboring counties too. San Bernardino saw a 26% rise, Riverside 12%, and San Diego 22%. Studies show that unaffordable rent and lack of income are the primary factors in the rise in homelessness. Now, LASA said the point in time count was recorded back in January. So efforts that were put into place over the past six months, including Mayor Karen Bass's Inside Safe program, would not be reflected in these numbers. Inside Safe is the mayor's effort to bring people off the streets. Now, earlier this month, Bass announced that more than 14,000 people moved into interim or permanent housing. The city and county are on track to create about 8,000 affordable homes this year, but leaders today acknowledge that more is needed. I wonder what the numbers are going to look like when you include Inside Safe because you had the amount of time it takes for an unsheltered person to accept interim housing at 61 days. Well, when we're on the streets, we're getting people to accept housing in three days. And one of the things I think that we have demonstrated is people do not want to be on the street. People will accept housing. Inside Safe, just one of the efforts that were made in the past six months. Also, since January, the mayor and the LA County Board of Supervisors declared a state of emergency. Also, LASA says they've created a multi departmental crisis response team which aims to decrease the time it takes to move people indoors. But even with this progress, the mayor says that she is concerned about the numbers next year, and we'll talk more about that coming up in the next hour. Reporting live in downtown, Kimberly Chang, KTLA 5 News. All right.